The Extreme Grip MLT anchor system is run in hole and oriented high side and sets in place. Due to the mechanical and hydraulic robustness of the Extreme Grip MLT anchor system, it can also double as the lower completion liner hanger, therefore reducing equipment and an additional trip. The Millwright milling machine is run in hole and oriented. The first pass window is milled out. An initial window opening is then milled in the casing at the desired location. Unlike conventional windows, this window is long and straight with a known geometry. There is no roll-off effect, ensuring ease of access for all milling, drilling and completion assemblies. A straight pull will free the milling machine from the anchor system and the assembly can then be pulled out. A washover whipstock is run in hole on bolted mills and oriented into the Extreme Grip MLT anchor system. The milling assembly opens the window to full diameter and a short rat hole is drilled, starting the lateral branch. The milling assembly is then pulled out, completing phase one of operations. At this point, the lateral drilling assembly is picked up and the lateral is drilled to total depth. A liner is then run to depth and cemented in place. Cement placed past the window provides junction integrity. Once the liner is cemented in place, the wiper dart is launched behind the cement and lands in the plug assembly. The running tool is released and pulled out of the hole. Cement is cleaned out from the lateral liner and main bore casing. Clean out trips can be done on a combination string to reduce trips. The transition joint is sliced off, flush to the ID of the casing using the washover assembly. The wash pipe washes over the whipstock and the external slips on the whipstock engage the wash pipe to allow retrieval with the washover assembly. The well is completed and workover operations in the lateral liner can be performed with a workover whipstock to re-enter the lateral liner.